Hello, my name is Shirish Rastro and this is my video blog. In this blog, I want to tell you about the new year. The new year is coming and the time for setting up new goals has come. There are lots of articles that I have read on Medium and on internet which says that people set a lot of goals in new year and uh, does not uh, continue with them throughout the year. They follow it for first uh, uh, for five, four days and uh, then, then they start losing it. But that is no reason for you not to set goals. Just because you have failed uh, following the goals and the set of things that you have set for yourself does not mean that you do not have to set the goals again. Uh, I have been setting up goals for last four years and there has been time that I have been failing again and again in following those goals and achieving those goals. But that does not stop me from setting new goals. Every month, every year I set new goals and I try to achieve them. Even if I cover 50% of those goals, I feel myself very lucky because most of the people don't even reach 1 or 2% of those goals. I would suggest don't take, don't listen to other negative bullshit that is on the internet about new year and not setting goals uh, every new year uh, at uh, 12 o'clock i sit in my home i don't go to party i don't go anywhere and i sit in my home and i just write down the things that i want to do that year there are things that i want to achieve that year buy that year the amount of money that i want to earn that year the night of the amount of people i want to meet that year the amount of activities that i want to do that year i just write everything down and one of the most important things while writing those goals is that write everything in details and give them a specific number and deadlines don't just write things in a very uh, random manner to, uh, and don't like write things like i want to be a good man i want to be a good human being i want to be a nice guy because that is something that you cannot achieve that is something that is very relative you want to be a good man but in relative to what you want to be a nice person but in relative to what if you want to be a good human being you don't know whether you want to compare yourself to mother teresa or you want to compare yourself to donald trump the thing is your goals has to be specific something that you can practically achieve and feel happy about you don't know when you're going to be a nice man and what is the limit to it your goals needs to have a limit and you need to know it if you are setting up a goals of writing an article you have to write the specific number of articles that you're going to write and by the date that you're going to write all of those articles if there's an amount of money that you want to earn you have to write the specific amount of money that you want to earn and you also have to write the date by which you want to acquire that money the important thing is you need to have a specific goal and you need to actually have the goal something that you can imagine for example if you're writing a uh, if you're uh, trying to tell the world that you want to earn that much amount of money then you should write yourself a check about that money and then keep it in front of you keep it inside your diary or post it inside on the wall of your room and then see it every day that is going to help you because that way you can actually physically see it happening human beings think in images one of the things that I again and again tell people and uh, one of the things that I learned from this documentary secret. So if you're setting up goals, I would suggest that whatever diary you are using, put those goals and make some effort to make those goals. Like if you are writing 10 goals, then put and then take out all the pictures from internet, uh, print them, cut them and put it on your diary and uh, uh, so that you can see them every day and realize that this is what you want to achieve. If you want to buy a MacBook Pro next year, just take out a printout of MacBook Pro form and the, the rate list of that uh, particular product and the money that you have to earn to buy that particular product. So this is how you should set your goals and never be demotivated uh, when other people just say that your goals won't work. One of the most important goals that people keep every year is of going to gym. It doesn't matter whether you go to gym or one or two days whether your motivation lacks what matters is that every time you lose every time you fail to go to gym you get up and again go to gym idea behind going to the gym is not that you have to go to the gym every day and just because you have missed one day doesn't mean that your entire process is ruined you can again start the process you again till you achieve what you want to achieve you do not have to stop just because uh, the pattern you have set for yourself the rules that you have set for yourself are not working they will work if you just if you just be persistent and keep on following them so i would suggest this new year set as many goals as possible uh, write them in as many specific ways as you can and then try to follow them as many goals as you possibly can and does not care whether you follow them or not if you fail to follow them i start again keep start again basic idea is to start the goals again and again so that you achieve them one day it's not uh, something like you will achieve your goals in two days or three days it will take a lot of time People are losing patience because uh, they think that just because they have written the goal, they will achieve it within no time. That's unrealistic. You have to have the patience. There's, a, there's lots of people who set the goals and they don't do it. And if you keep on starting the goals again and again after you are failing to achieve that goal, you will be one of those few people who are persistent enough to chase your goal even though you are failing again and again. So write your goals and wait for next year because 2019 is going to be a fabulous year for every one of us. Thank you.